Hello everyone. Today we will learn about checks cash, PD checks cash, and PD checks payment. First of all, we'll learn about checks cash, or you can also press Alt U for the same. Now press Enter. As you select the checks cash option, a ledger window will appear in front of you, where four ledgers will be displayed shown to you. That is, Bank of Baroda, cash. Cash discount and short and excess. Whatever the entries to be made by checks will be entered in bank, and whatever the entries to be made by cash will be entered in cash ledger. Cash discount is basically given here. If any party has done the payment before the payment date, then we can provide him discount in order to give him as regard. Next is short and excess. If some party has done the payment of rupees two thousand nine hundred, and the actual payment amount is rupees two thousand nine hundred three, then we'll put rupees three in short and excess field. Similarly, if party had done the payment of rupees two thousand nine hundred ten, then rupees seven is to be put in short and excess field. Now let's see its entry. First, we press Enter on Bank of Baroda. Now we'll put entry number, like we enter double zero one, and then we'll enter tag number. If we previously tagged any bills, then it will show all the bills tagged in Bank of Baroda with bill number and party name. If you wanna add bill number, then you can add the bill number manually. And if you don't know the bill number, then you can press right arrow key, and you can only enter the party name. Like we select Pankaj Pharma, then enter the check or DD number, then date, amount, and short if any. So in this way we can do the adjustment. Similarly, we select next party, like we select Saluja Medicine Center. Now suppose this party do the payment in cash. So for that, you will press right arrow key, then enter date, and then enter the amount in amount field, and then adjust it. And now here you can see it's showing you cash. Now after that, you can see at the above that some of the bill where we didn't mention any value, we can return them by pressing plus key. So they will again goes back to outstanding. So now press end key to save it. If you wanna view it, then you can view that, and if you wanna print it, then you can do the same. Now next is PD checks cash. PD means post dated. If we have got check of future date, suppose. Today's date is first April, and the PD check that we received is of fifteen April. So for that you will use the PD check cash option, or you can also press Alt Q for the same. Now press Enter. Then we'll enter the tag number, entry date, area, bill number if any. Otherwise enter the party name. To enter the party name, first you will press right arrow key. Then select the party. For example, we select Pankaj Pharma. Then enter the PDC or DD number. Then enter the date. And then enter the amount. And after that, adjust it. And finally, we save it by pressing End key. So in this way, you can use the option PD checks cash. After that, you will see the next option is PD checks payment. If you do the payment of post dated checks, then you will select this option. Then we select the ledger Bank of Baroda. Then select the party like we select Siegel Pharmaceuticals. Then enter the check number, date, and then enter the amount. If you wanna print it, then you can print it 
Otherwise, you can save the changes by pressing end key. So friends, in this tutorial, you have seen how to use checks cash, PD checks cash and PD checks payment option in Microsoft view. Thank you.